So I got a um, pretty depressing story about the first time I bought, or within the first couple of weeks of, of having my, my Challenger. Um, so, all right, I'm exiting the freeway and it's a semi truck in front of me. It's probably like four or five car lengths ahead of me. And uh, the lane is merging. So I don't want to sit behind that truck. You know what I'm saying? So I floor it. Like I put I put the pedal on the floor and I'm, I'm hitting it. <laughs> but the sad part about it is that I wasn't going nowhere. Like it felt like I was literally inching up on this, this truck. And the only option was <laughs> you either was going to pass it or you was going to end up in the dirt or in the in the, in the in the gravel on the side of the road. And so I'm hitting, I'm flooring it, and my joint ain't going nowhere. It's taking forever to get past this truck. Like, I feel like the truck slowed down because it felt sorry for me. <laughs> it felt sorry for me. Like, I'ma just, I'ma just let this, this Challenger pass. And man, it was so depressing, man. I felt, I felt like deflated. I was like, man, I, I wasn't expecting my car to be like that, man. Like I know it's it's not the quickest, the fastest car out there by far, but I didn't think it would struggle to pass a semi truck that was four or five car lengths ahead of me. Uh, probably a little bit more than that. But anyways, um, so I had to regroup. I went home, <laughs> wiped my tears, and then I, I went to uh, American Muscle and got a cold air intake. I bought one of those. And that was that was an immediate difference. Like I I heard it, you know, it's, it got that aggressive sound, and also uh, it made me quicker off the line. Like I felt the difference. Like it, if you're talking about modding your car, um, that's probably one of the first things you should do if you want that a, a better acceleration. Um, so I did that. I mean, I got the rear muffler delete, and I, I exchanged the resonators too, but. Um, as far as performance and sound goes, the cold air intake was was hitting like right away. Um, not saying I, I beat a V8 because that's clearly not possible unless I got a supercharger. But um, I'm, I noticed a difference. I noticed a difference. So uh, after that, I got the throttle controller. And so when you put the when you put the throttle controller on, and then you click the your car in sport mode man this joint is like it's begging me to go like it's begging me to hit the gas it's begging me to be like it's like please sir please just let me go fast please please like and so you 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 feel like you got to give in and you're not gonna get like 50 100 horsepower you're not gonna get none of that like you just gonna feel like you got it <laughs> you're gonna feel like you got it and um the cold air intake the throttle controller rear muffler delete uh, and the mini bullets as the resonators. Those are the mods that that I have for my, my V6 Challenger. And it makes a difference. Like it makes a, a complete difference. Like if you, it's not, none of them are expensive. Um, the cold air intake was probably the most expensive. I was like uh, two, $300, depending on what brand it can get higher than that. Um, but I got the, the brand that's like in the middle of the pack. You know, I know it's a K&N that really, I should have, and, and thinking back, like I, I should have just got that one. Um, but either way, this one is this one is solid. I got a uh, Spectra um, cold air intake. So that embarrassing story made me think about ways to enhance my performance, and it works. Um, I'm satisfied. Uh, if I upgrade, it's not going to be to like an RT or nothing, because it's not a real big difference from an RT to I mean from a V6 to an RT. So I, I, I like the TA. Um, but that's later, you know, I'm, I'm still chilling with my, my V6, having fun in it, um, looking good in it. Um, got the racing stripes. The racing stripes add like 700 horsepower though, like for real. All right, maybe like 650 or so. Um, but yeah, that's other than that, man, uh, it's, 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 it's some good upgrades. So if you're looking to, to increase the performance sound of your V6 Challenger, um, those are the ways to go at least in my book you know if you got your own book you got your own way to do it blah 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 um but that's just my way and there's a lot of other people way too but yeah that's it